truth is, our body is meant to sleep at night, not drive. So driving between 4 a.m. and 6 a.m. is the most dangerous time to be on the road. There's a good chance you'll come across other drivers who are fatigued or even intoxicated. Plus, you'll probably be pretty tired yourself, so your judgment, focus, and ability to react to hazards will all be compromised. What is the most dangerous time to drive for people who work at night? 10 p.m. to midnight, 1 a.m. to 3 a.m., or 4 a.m. to 6 a.m.? If you're sleep-deprived or driving at a time when you'd normally be asleep, you also face the danger of microsleeps, brief involuntary lapses of consciousness that occur when you can't stay awake. It's impossible to drive safely when you're fatigued enough to drift off behind the wheel. If you have a 4-second microsleep while driving 60 miles per hour, you'll travel 360 feet with the car totally out of your control. A lot can happen in those few seconds that you won't be able to undo, ever. It's up to you to be aware of what your body is telling you, so you can make smart, safe decisions if you're driving without enough sleep. If your eyelids are heavy, you're blinking a lot, or you're feeling irritable, it may be time to take a break from the driver's seat. You also have to pay attention to what your driving is telling you. If you're veering over lane lines, varying your speed, or exhibiting any other unsafe driving behavior, it's definitely time to pull over and get some rest. Even if your schedule requires you to drive at late night or early morning hours, there are things you can do to lower your risk. Maintain a regular sleep routine and avoid caffeine, sleeping pills, alcohol, and nicotine before going to bed. Take extra steps to avoid distractions before starting the car. If you're driving for long periods of time, night or day, take regular breaks for at least 15 minutes every two hours or sooner if you need it. Driving just 80 minutes without a break can slow your reaction time and make you a danger on the road. So if you're feeling tired, stop at a safe place to get some fresh air and stretch your legs. Yeah, it might add a few minutes to your trip, but at least you'll arrive in one piece. Work is important, but so is sleep. Take care of yourself and make sure you're well-rested before getting behind the wheel.